welcome to Madhouse Militia Presents, episode 120, A Slice of Life. From our July 26th through 27th, 2024 show, we trim the Wi-Fi trees, get lost and found, Pam doesn't care. The situation unfolds. Johan is an unhired bathroom attendant. Tim really doesn't want to discuss sexuality. Let's make it happen. The best and worst customer service is a strange thread woven into this entire episode. Let them know. Taco delivery. Not an AI or a bot. Hotel persons. Aliens are real. Toilet disturbances. Dwight goes hunting for celebrities. Snappy bakes. Uh, crickets take over the airwaves. Lots of man questions and a vote of confidence to have fun. Be sure to check out our products on Patreon at patreon.com forward slash madhouse militia slash shop. This show features calls by Snappy Bakes, DTB, Catastrophe, Mad Hatter, Dwight the Janitor, Big Boy Fart 666, Turbo, Xenorax, Wasted Memory, Milkman, and Axpa. Thank you to everyone for helping make the show go, by the way. I wish to give thanks to Dwight the Janitor, Wasted Memory for RogueServer.com, where we broadcast every Friday night at 10 p.m. Eastern, 7 p.m. Pacific, Dragomir for Corndown.com, where he broadcasts every Friday night at 7 p.m. Eastern, 4 p.m. Pacific. We also wish to give thanks to our patrons, such as Carlos T, Klusritz, Experts, Brian N, Mig Chungus, Jayad, Brian T, Travis B, Gold Rust, Gordo, Parkman, Crispy808, MST3 Clay, Fancy Pants, Anonymous, Mr. Turbois, Phone Losers of America, Benjamin, Despicable Dogs, Big Boy Farts 666, Jesus Paynus, and Turbo the High Level Squirrel. If you wish to give us a, a ringy ding, or really an email, send an email over at travelswithmiriam, M I R I A M, at gmail.com. You can check out our old show at travelswithmiriam.com. You can find our archives on archive.org under the Immoral Hole archives. You can find out more about the show at immoralhole.com. Be sure to check out horseycat.com. You can find our YouTube at Madhouse Militia and our TikTok at Immoral Hole. If you wish to contribute to the show via methods other than Patreon, check out immoralhole.com forward slash show forward slash contribute. Thank you for calling the Sioux Falls Clubhouse Hotel and Suites. John, how can I help you? Hi, you know how the doors here, there's like a little door that like it's locked, but it can, if I were to open it, it goes into the next person's room. You know that little door? Oh, the... Yeah, the uh, the dividing door with that we have with some of these rooms. Yeah, I'm in one, and like I hear the dude, and I think he needs help in there, dude. You should go check on him because he's, he's taking a shit or something. Oh, uh, which room are we in? Can you hear him? Yeah, I can hear him, but I need to know which ro- which room you're in so I can so I can help. Oh my god. Yeah, if you can't. Hey, are you good in there, bro? Are you okay? Hold on, I'm asking him for you, okay? You good, bro? I don't know if this guy's good. Yeah, which room are you in? I can't help you if you don't tell me. I'll tell you his number. It's 16. What's that? 216. 216? Okay, I'll take a look. Wait. Stay. Good evening. Thank you for calling the hotel on Phillips. This is Phil. How can I direct your call? Hey, Big Phil, how are you doing, buddy? Doing real good. How can I assist? So, you know how there's, like, the person next door, he's in the room next door? Person's in the room next door? Mm, not not sure what you're talking about. Yeah, sorry, I'm I'm kind of drunk, but, like, the man next door, he, I can hear him, dude. Okay, where, what room are you in? Oh. Can you hear him? I think he, he's taking the shit. What room are you in? What room are you in? Hold, hold on. Hey, you good, bro? Hey. 
You good, oh. bro? I think he's getting fucked. What fuck room me. are you in? I th- fuck me. I'm in 216. He's right here. The guy's right here. I think he's getting fucked. 216. Fuck me. Hey, fuck me. Fuck me. You want me to fuck right now, bro? Fuck me. I'm reeking by the pillow. Fuck me. John Lennon's a big fat cunt. Hi, please. How can I help you? Hey, what? my friend Turbo right here, he wants to tell you something. My friend Turbo. Um, okay. Yeah, I was out in the parking lot, and uh, there's some guy who's dressed up kind of like John Lennon, and uh, he tried to kick me. Does he Is work he in the parking you? lot right now? No, we don't have any men that work with us. Oh, okay. he's in the. Yeah. He's in the. He's in the parking lot right now. Well, he yeah, he's singing us so. Beatles songs. Okay, okay. So in the front parking lot, someone tried to kick you. Yeah. And oh, he's out yes. there right now, Go or he's house. not. Go to my home. He is. He is. Okay, I can go take a look. He, he's playing a kick drum, and he looks. He's dressed like John Lennon, and he's singing me and Turbo Beatles songs because he thinks. You hear him? He's just like screaming weird. Out there? Okay, yeah, I'll go handle that. Here, ask Turbo. Here, Turbo's the one that saw him. Yeah, he's wearing some kind of big weird shoes. That's out in the parking lot right now? Yeah, yeah. Looks exactly like John Lennon. I'm going to take my pants off again. No, no, bro, the Asian lady's right there. She'll see you. Oh, he needs to be room. Does he need to? That's in our parking? Okay, I'll go. I'm going to come outside. Hey, give me your phone. Give me your phone. I'm going to run. I got their phone. I got their phone now. Now you can't, they can't give you any more information. I'm, I'm running. I'm running. Now they can't give you any more information. Hey, I'll run with my pants off. No, no. No, you can't even catch me. I got my pants around my ankles. Hey, you dollar store gentleman. Oh, Lennon. come on, man. Give me that. Please, give me my phone, man. Oh, no. No, it's just iPhone. I hope it's an iPhone because it's going in the fountain. I hope it's waterproof. Oh, please, man. Please, my wife going to kill me, man. Please. <laughs> what is going on? You're going in the fountain. In the fountain. No, man. Please. I'll do anything for my phone. Please just. Hello? Thank you for calling in. And this is Kennedy. Hi, How may yeah, I, I heard it's your birthday, so we're going to sing you happy birthday. All right, everybody. A one, a two, a three. Happy birthday, happy birthday to you. It's happy birthday. Transfer to my brother's room, please. Uh huh. Uh, was his name, or do you know that room? Uh, yep, yep. Last name is spelled K A S S I R. First name of John. Oh. So K A 
S S I R. Yep. Mm, there's nobody with that last name. Well, that's stupid. Um, can I give you a different name? Go ahead. Yeah, last name. Oh, okay. All right. Uh, let's see. Okay, so the last name on this feller is uh, F O R E E. S O R E E. Yeah, F is in Frank, O is in open, R is in Randy, E is in Edward, E is in Edward. Okay, let's try that. All right. I can't find any of them. Is it? Are they in the oh, Western? Are they in yep, the Western? Yeah, yeah, yep. How about the last name of Todd, T-O-D-D? T-O-D-D. First name of Tony. Tony, T-O-D-D. No. They're coming today? Tony Todd. Yeah, yeah. He's, he's He's very famous, yeah. He's there for the convention. Okay, what was the first one you said? Let me try that one again. Oh, uh, the first one was uh, K-A-S-S-I-R. First name of John. John. Well, nothing with the last name. Yeah, yeah. So you you found him? No, I can't find him with that last ah. name. Oh, you would know him, too, because he sleeps in a crypt. Oh. Yeah. It's sad. It's it's sad. He's got a Michael Jackson-looking nose. Sad. Uh, okay. I, I guess they're not I guess they're not there. What do you know? You know, what you, what you're going to do? Do you know where the celebrities are staying for the con- for the Comic Con or the convention? Where are the celebrities staying at? We, I know we have uh, people coming in for that here, but I just don't find that person. Oh, but the but the celebrities aren't staying there. I'm not. I'm not sure. I'm not. Did we find them by their name? But then nobody's coming out with that name. Oh yeah, that's probably not good then. Damn. 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 Said, damn. I was I'm just sorry. trying to get phone autograph. I was just trying to get phone autographs. <laughs> I was trying to get them to autograph my phone with their voice. Sorry, I can't find them. <laughs> okay, I just want you to let you know that you're an ac- you're an accomplice at this point. You're my alibi. If I get in trouble, I'm going to tell them to call you. <laughs> Anything else I can do right. with that? Nope, that's it. I just want to let you know that we're now married men and women. I may now kiss you <laughs> as my bride. <laughs> Have a good one, sir. Take care. Okay. Bye. In the United States. Hi, we just see Lama. She's is Anna speaking. Hi. Do you say Lama? Anna. Oh, I thought I, I was like, wait a minute. Why? I, could, I totally called the wrong place. Uh, no, I'm trying to get transferred to my brother's room, if I could, please. Yes, okay. What's your brother's number? Room number. Uh, oh, I don't know. He didn't have one assigned when he left the house. What is his name? His uh, last name is spelled K-A-S-S-I-R. First of John. Let me see here. Mm, I don't have anybody under that name. No? No. Oh, man, that's just that's disappointing. Um, can I, uh, what, what, what floor do you keep all the white women at? I'm sorry? Because that's where he would be. Like, what floor has, a, has the biggest ratio of white women? And I'll go find him. I, I wouldn't be able to tell you that, sir. What, you don't keep those statistics or you're, yeah, you're we, just not allowed? We, no, we don't keep those statistics. Okay. Well, I'll, I'll just go floor to floor and just do a little knocking. I'll do a self-survey then. All right. I appreciate it. Uh, 
I'll find him. Okay. You have a good day. Okay, bye. Bye-bye. Open the door. Open the door. I got a question for you. Come on. Hey, I open the door. I need to ask you something. Fuck you. Is love. John in there? We want to make love. Hey. Victoria Good Price. evening. Thank you very much for calling Marathon Downtown Long Beach. How may I see you this evening? Hi, I gotta have my brother's room, please. I'm so sorry. Who would you like to speak with? Jo- his last name is K A S S I R. I can I have the first name of the guest? John. Okay. Can I have your name, sir? My name? Yeah, absolutely. May may I have your name, sir? Oh, oh, you want it now? Yeah, yeah. It, my name is also John. One moment, please. Thank you. Oh, okay. Thank you very much for your patience, Mr. John. Um, unfortunately, sir, I wasn't able to get in contact with anyone in the room. Uh, okay. He he might be out to dinner. I'll try again later. Okay. Thank you, Mr. John. Have a lovely evening. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Good evening. Thank you for calling my place, Sioux Falls. This is Jeff. How may I help you? I love these tacos, bro. Thank you. I'm sorry? You sent these tacos up to my room, right? I didn't send anything up to your room. Your name's John, right? This is the front desk. Yeah, but your name's John, right? Uh, It's Jeff. Jeff, yeah, whoever you sent me these tacos, big boy. Uh, I didn't send any tacos. What room? You want to come up to my room and have some with me? I got some guests. Thank you. Front desk, how may I help you? Keep beating. Hello? Weak, weak beating. I'm sorry? This, we keep on eating. You want to eat, eat more? Eat more food? No. You must, you must eat it. No, please. So you are big and full and you cannot have any more. Oh, please, no. But if you throw oh. up, I swear on everything, I swear. No, please, no more. You will not I throw cannot up. do it. You will take one more bite. Oh, please, no more. I love you. Tattoo plant. Hey, bro, I got a weird-ass oh. idea for a tattoo. I was wondering if you guys can do oh, it. Oh, man, we take those weird-ass ideas all day, and we make them, uh, we make them reality. What's up? Can I get a picture of you when you were a kid? <laughs> yeah, I'll send it over. Swear. Nah, for real. What do you want, dude? Seriously, that, dude. I lost a bet. All right. Let's make it happen. Fuck it. Do you guys do walks? I'll come right in. All right. Well, it's uh, 747 right now. Uh, what What should the clock Tomorrow? say when you come in? No, well, offer only tomorrow, stays like, tonight. Tomorrow. Well, what time you close, bro? Well, we close when we close, man. Just get your ass over here. Where you at? I'm coming through. I'm on my way. I'll be right there. The All right. I'll, I'll be waiting for you. What's your name? This is Hector. Hector. Hector Ramirez. Hector, Hector yeah. Big Nuts. Come in, dude. Ask for Joey. Hector, Hector the Titty Inspector. All right. Let's go. All right, come in, dude. I'll hook you up. Let's go. Um, all right, dope. Thanks. Later. Yeah. Tattoo Tattoo Planet. Planet. Hey, Hector. What's up, dog? Hi. Hi. Did you say that you were going to give my son a tattoo? Nope. I sure didn't. My son, Hector? Is your son Hector? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, Hector just called down here and said he lost a bet and wanted a tattoo. He didn't say what age he was, but I said that's what we do here. Yep. 
that we do do tattoos but he, here. It doesn't matter his age. He lives with his mother, and he is not getting a tattoo okay. when he lives well, in my house. Well, you need to discipline your son, because that boy is out of control. Okay. No, no, we are coming down there, and I'm going to give you a piece of my oh, mind. Oh, come so on, girl. I'm waiting for you. Home. Come see me. I'm, I'm, I'm come after Joe. Ask for Joe. Ask for Joe. I'll ask Joe. I'm on my yeah, way. Yeah, come on down. I want mom, mom dad. Oh, wait, I'm he probably doesn't have old, a father. Stop All it. right, so just mom. Let's He's go. Bye-bye. He, he makes poor choices. Oh, I think that's me. I forget how loud they are. Hello? Hey, my girlfriend, Snap, wants to, um, do you guys do weird-ass tattoos? Uh, it kind of just depends, and depends on what artist we have available. My my girlfriend, Snap, wants a tattoo of you. Just Y-O-U? Yeah. Where at? No, fool, you. No, you, you, you. I saw, because I saw you. And I just was like, you know what, that, and I went like, I smacked my arm. I'm like, that's been right here. I want that guy's mean mug on my, uh, I forget what the muscle name is there. Hamstring, but that, baby. It's called I, a hamstring. I going on there. Hamstring, my hamstring. Which artist is she trying to get a hold of? Cause there's like I think it was you, bro. You're that big fool. Which so there's like ten yeah. of us here. I want you to do it, and I want you to do it so it's like the like, big guy. Do who look like you? I don't do portraits. It was the big hmm. guy, bro. I don't know names. My, uh... Tattoo Mesa, how can I help you? Hey, uh, oh. Bappy wants to fuck. Yeah. I do, I do. Yeah, I'm big girl. Yes, <laughs> yes, Daddy. Hello. Yeah, how can we help you? Yes, listen, we will run out of towels up here in the room. Oh, you got the wrong number, girl or man. What do you What do you mean? Just... You got the wrong number. What do you mean? Where did I call? Dad, we. Call... Clitoris tattoo that says it's here. It's here. Don't Reach the emerald tattoo. Me. Please leave a message or text any. Record your message after the tone. Oh. Simply hang up when done. Or for delivery options, press the pound sign. I'll leave the message. There was a bit of a misunderstanding uh, when he said he wants to fuck. Um, that is me. It is I who wants to fuck. <coughs> And that's basically an idea I have for a tattoo, and I was hoping that you could accommodate some of my some of my um, ideas, such as uh, something on my clit. Uh, give us a call back. Uh, numbers on your caller ID. Fuck yeah, baby, I want to fuck that tattoo in your butt. Area 51, how may I help you? <laughs> Do you believe in aliens? Yes. Hello? All right. My friend Snappy right here, she swears they don't exist, so I need her to call someone to tell her. Oh, yeah. Did you have any questions? Can you tell her aliens are real? Yeah, tell her aliens are real. I can't. I got to go. Bye. Come on. (laughs) Bring your tattoo in Mesa. This is Isa. Hi, I'm sorry Hello? we got off onto a wrong foot. My boyfriend here, yeah, he wants to explain the tattoo he's looking for. Hello, you're here. Yeah, we're a walking face shop. Um, were you looking to come in and get a tattoo today? Yeah, we were going to walk in. Well, like, I'm from Germany, so things are a little different. I know America's, like, a little, like, tighter with some of these rules, but in other ways, Germany's tighter, and I'm just trying to figure out, like, uh, what you will do for us. Yeah, I mean, so, are you looking for a price? Well, I'm looking, yeah, like if you will do, even do the thing, because like in Germany, sometimes they will say, no, we will not do this, but like you will do like a couple of tattoos, possibly like could we pay you like maybe a little extra, we get the tattoos, the same tattoos. What at are you the looking to get done? 
Well, we want to let like a little. We have this little crest. It's like an emblem, and we are a polyamorous couple. So there will need to be like we like essentially like with three people at the same time to tattoo us. And it's like, is that possible? You think? Um, if you're coming in as a group, we would likely put you with the same artist, um, just so that all of the tattoos Very- match. Really yeah. like it at the same um, time, but if we can get as close as we can get it together, as long as it's the same day, because that's me and my boyfriend, yeah, we can. Uh, the milkman, and we have Schnappy as our girlfriend, and so we are polyamorous couple if you want. Polyamorous. Oh, yes, sounds great. Uh, just come in whenever you're ready. We're walking base shop and see what we can do for but you. But we will do like is we have a, like a Captain yep. Planet kind of ID, and so that we will do like. We'd really like to get some yeah. tattooed at uh, the we same can, time. We can figure that all out once uh, you come you. in. And we'll get it like, we'll, it's like, we'll, I don't know, I don't know like what you would put the tattoos. So, because we want them done also where you do like the boat cheek. Hello. Oh, it's not listen on. Talk to someone else. Maximus. Tell him on. Go on. Who is Maximus? Well, like, uh, do, do you know which of your artists has, like, designs that accommodate, like, kind of like the butt lip region? Ah. Da stehen Sie nicht, du verdammter Bitch. Hallo. What? Who's something about cigarettes? <laughs> Verdammter Bitch, it's called damn bitch not listen to talk to that fourth friend or something. Hello? She not listen. We just want the Captain Planet tattoos on the anus, your power combined or no, no, no! <laughs> Combined, I am bleeding out so of my hard. eyelids. So hard, I lost my lip oh. oh. I just wanted a tattoo to commemorate our love. <laughs> oh shit! Dang, boy, you just got in a car accident. Yes. Well, I'm sorry, German guy. I, you just got in a car accident, but today's your unlucky day. I'm unbuckling your pants. No, I cannot feel my nubina on my legs, please. Oh, uh, it's yours. Oh, stop him! Stop him! Please. Will you please at least tie a tourniquet for my severed hands while you are fucking me, please? That looks so sexy. Look at that. It's straight. It's straight like Oh, no. Wait, this is kinky. This is... Wait. You like that? Oh. Oh, the pain. The pleasure. Thank you for calling the award-winning Quality Inn and Sweets North. This is Mandy. How can I help you? Mandy, is there a man I can talk to? I have a question. Is there a manager here right now? Unfortunately. A man, a guy. No, there's no other. There's no men working right now. Well, can I ask you then? You sure can. Okay, this is kind of embarrassing, but I'm I'm 20 years old, so I don't know much, and... I have a girl coming over to the hotel, and I think we might do stuff, and I want to know how do I start it. Like, what do I do? And I don't want to sound weird or creepy, but I need help because I've never done this, and I'm scared and nervous. And she's going to come over, and 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 I'm, and I'm just want to start it because, you know, she's so pretty beautiful. What the fuck? What a bitch. Oh, thank you for calling this is Paul Sheraton. How can I assist you? Is there a man? How can I help you? 
I need to talk to a man I don't think you'll understand as a lady. There is no man here that can assist you. Is there anything I can help you with? Um, it's kind of personal. Do you mind helping me out? Hello? Oh, hi. Is there a lady there I can talk to? No. Okay, this is kind of embarrassing. Um... I have a guy coming over because, like, he's oh so cute. Um, I'm just a little nervous because it's been a while since I've actually got into the business with a gentleman, and I forget really what to do. Oh, he's hanging dog, yeah. and I'm scared. Can you call back after one hour? The lady will be available at that time. No! No, I can't. Is your line going to be better then? Sorry? Is your phone line going to be better? You sound like you're talking on a tin can. Beppy? Yes? Beppy, is that you? Uh, oh, he's here. Yes, Puppy. It's me. He's here. Hi, baby. Hi. Oh, I miss you so much. I miss it. I miss you. I want to kiss. Give me sweet kisses. I kiss you all over my body, please. Give me kisses. Oh. oh, I feel so good for you. That is not okay. Thanks for calling it's to Dakota. How, this is Bobby. How can I help you? Hello? <clears throat> Hello? Hi, yeah. This is the Dakota. Son. How can I help you? Yeah, hi. My oh, son. What's here. going on? What is. Bappy? Hello? 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 Yeah, what is this like oh, a I'm three so four way? Yeah. yeah, this is a big. It's a. Oh, we're trying to reach out to someone. Okay, uh, so you called the Dakota a, Hotel. A bit of a. Correct. Okay. It's a, It's 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 one of the. Yes, it's a it's it's a party line, but it's this is no party. We're trying to um reach. We're trying to make a connection to you, in regards. To um, our cousin who's coming along, and there's something, and it's ringing, and that it's. I'm just a little discombobulated, but um, you can understand how my confusion grew at this point. No, I don't actually, because I don't understand the situation as of yet. Maybe you can explain it to me. Yeah. The sort of yes. were on the phone. I was going to reach out to speak to someone regarding a gentleman who was going to be coming to the room. Uh huh. And it's been a while since something like that's happened, and I was hoping I could like kind of get some advice, um, and like kind of that someone with whom I could speak comfortably about like how I kind of prepare myself for like what to do. Woman when to woman. To your room? I don't understand what you're saying. Well, like you my, were having my, a guest this gentleman, coming? This gentleman who are this... Do you know this gentleman? Yeah, I guess. He's like, I know him. It's okay. We've met before. We've crossed paths. Yes, I know okay. him. I know him. Like, I don't... It's just that I, I, he's really, really cute. Like, I find him very attractive. And I just... It's like, you know, woman to woman... How do I prepare myself for like you know what to what to what do? Bit. Hello, Steve Ross. Uh-huh. Hey, bro. Hey, bro. I have a question. Hello. Sure. Hello. Can you hear me? I um, can. So I, it's it's been a while since I had a girl come through, and I convinced her to come you know kick it with me in the room. Um, 
I'm pretty sure I'm gonna fuck. But how do I start? Like, how do I get her? Like, how do I not sound awkward or weird or creepy? Like, how do I start this shit, bro? Uh, the same way you started with me. But the quality is shit, so good luck. Thanks for calling the Holiday and Sweets. This is Kim. How can I help you? Oh, hello, Kim. Can, is that, um, so it's a little awkward. It's my first time staying in the country from Germany. I'm wondering, like, if is there a man that I can speak to? This is? Oh, a man? You are a man? This is the manager. Yes. Oh, I, no, I, I was talk. I'm trying to uh, maybe, like, it was just, like, a sensitive issue. If I feel like a man will perhaps understand it a bit better, but... I, if you are bear with me, oh. I will explain oh. to you. <laughs> there is no, there is no males. I apologize. Okay, so that's fine. I apologize. I'm new from Germany, so if I say the wrong word, please forgive. Excuse. Okay. Uh, so uh, what I'm wondering is like, m- men's like no have the how you say like. Menstruation, like the um, men don't have like the period, do they? Right? Like that's they don't have that, right? No. Right. That's what I was thinking. But like, I mean, I got kind of a problem, and so I was saying, like, I want to talk to a man. Like maybe another man will know what's going on here, because I like I just like a drop or two. Like it's red. It's a rot as blood. It's a blood on the thing, and so. I'm not sure what I'm going to do. Um, yeah, maybe try, an, or, or maybe try another hotel where there's a male working, but there's not one working here tonight. But I'm not staying in another hotel. I stay in your hotel. And what room are you in? Well, right now I'm in the bathroom, and I'm really, like, freaking out a little bit, man. In which bathroom? Is there no, if there's no man there, as in in my room, the bathroom, and maybe I. In what in I what room number? There. there was a nice man who he is, say he we met out in the hall. He say he was like a he had like he was like a a pillow salesman or something, like taco pillows or something. He say he said I maybe I go knock on his door, and he will tell me or something. I go do that. Hang on, one one second here. Hello, sir. Oh, hey. Oh, hello. Pardon, you. Uh, can I talk to you for a moment? I'm busy with my wife. Oh, Happy. I'm sorry. Um, but I have a bit of a problem. Maybe I just need to talk to a man. There's a guy right here, baby. There's a there's a pussy. Oh. Well, there's there's no man in the hotel. Thank you for calling Holiday Inn Express. This is Aaron. Hello, hello Aaron. Was there like yes. a guy? Is there like a guy working there? Hello, hello. Yes. Can you is hear there me? Is there like a guy working there too? Not tonight, hun. No. Uh, I can hear you. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Can you hear me? Uh, okay. Uh, it's just you working there. Yeah, there's like a delay. Delay. Can you hear me, hun? There's a big delay. Did you not? Are you a bot? Do you know what a delay means? Do you speak English? I do know what a delay means. I do speak English. I'm speaking to you right now. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm just, it's like, it's just, I wasn't sure what was going on. I was getting frustrated because I thought that there was a man who was out there giving like wacky advice to this, this, this male man, this man who, that I was just doing something with and it was really bad advice. Um, you're at the hotel right now? Well, I was passing through. I'm on my way out. Okay, I need to put you on hold. No. Dude, that's so far. What? Is that the same hotel? That, am I confused? 
ఒక్కొక్కసారి కాలింగ్ చేయండి ఇస్ క్వాలిటీ ఇన్నన్ సర్ హలో హలో హౌ ఆర్ యు డూయింగ్ టుడే గుడ్ హౌ ఆర్ యు ఐ యామ్ గుడ్ ఐ యామ్ హియర్ విత్ మై వైఫ్ అండ్ షీ హాస్ క్వశ్చన్స్ ఫర్ యు హియర్ టేక్ ద ఫోన్ హనీ హలో హౌ ఆర్ యు గుడ్ హౌ ఆర్ యు not too bad can't complain uh some questions oh is there a deer in the lot what oh i got i heard a noise and i got distracted but um i wanted to see one on over in there with basically being disrobed on the property okay is that permitted Okay I mean your voice is breaking I can't understand sorry for that <laughs> Hello No you maybe mm. speak to me don't speak above to the man It is I mean the voice is very low that's why sorry for that Hello Yeah you can now it is good Oh no I can't be any closer Is it better now? now it is good. Yeah, now it is good. Sorry for that. The yeah. Wi-Fi? Oh, the Wi-Fi is low. There oh, is no password for Wi-Fi. Oh, I'm saying wife. The wi- I thought you were talking down about me. No, silly, no. We're getting a... We're, I thought you were disrespecting me, but now I understand. No, ma'am. The Wi-Fi tree? Yeah, did someone trim the Wi-Fi no, tree? No. Wi-Fi tree? My wife is low. You're putting me down. You're putting down the wife. Chop down the internet. No, ma'am. I'm I'm not putting that. Chop it down. No, ma'am. Owl hat. I was going to be wearing no... Get our house off that damn internet. Hello? Hello, yes ma'am. Hi. No, I'm a sir. How dare you? Yes sir, yes sir. Yeah, okay. So, uh did you get it? You got all the information from my wife? No ma'am, no sir. I didn't understand. Sorry for that. Oh, okay. So, what what do you need from me to get this all sorted? I mean, you can ask sir i didn't understand anything sorry for that oh okay all right uh well we we were dr- we were walking on by earlier we saw a man and he was selling tacos uh from a little taco stand but then he started following us with his taco uh stand and we were wondering cuz he's still following us it's been a couple hours now we've been walking through the city trying to you know shake him trying to get away from him but he keeps following us and he says he's the taco man and he has tacos for us and then we asked him well, well, why are you following us he said oh i work at the hotel i work at the hotel i have to sell them the tacos i have to sell the tacos oh okay our hotel is located you? at i mean our hotel is located at yeah no we were there <laughs> we were there we were walking by and he was in the parking lot and he started oh, can i come and check from there Well, it's, Can I come? we're a couple blocks away now. We're we're pretty pretty far away because it's been a couple Andy hours. Taco. And he says, and you know, everyone buys his tacos, and you will too. And then he says, spit on me, spit on me a whole. No, time. no, no. And he says, no, no, no. He's here. You hear him? See. Si. Yeah, I'll give him the phone. Here, you talk to him. You explain yourself to him. Maybe this will make more sense. Hello, okay? senor. Hello. 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 They say uh, you will buy the taco. No, we are not by the taco. We are si. at the. Uh... Sorry, sir. Si. I yes, we are by the taco. Please come to the motel. Yes, at the motel. Yes, si. The taco. I sell the taco at the back. No. By the dumpster. No. Uh, no. Said the taco. No. 
Yeah, you see. It is not good. I said the taco for. <laughs> Fuck. Thank you for calling Arrowhead Hotel of Sioux Falls. This is Sarah. How can I help you? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes, I can. Do I sound funny? Um, I don't think so. There's a girl coming over to my room. Um, she's a friend of mine, and I finally convinced her to go out and drink with me. And I'm really scared and nervous because she's so pretty. Uh, is there any way, advice you can give me? I've never. Can done I ask who's calling? Can I ask who's calling? This is this is Big Hector, aka Daddy Fat Sex. Yep, I think you might be uh, calling the wrong person. Is this a hotel lady? This is a hotel person. I'm st- I'm staying in your hotel. No- hey. hey. Who 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 are you um, to? This the lady at the hotel. Um, she was uh, gonna upgrade our room. She was gonna upgrade our room. <laughs> was this is this really? Here, talk to her. Talk to her. That that's against the rules. Did... Hello. May I ask who I'm speaking with? Hello? Hi, can I ask who I'm speaking with? My, this is Big Bappy. This is Big Bappy. I'm being paid by the hour. Babe. I'm being paid currently. Please, be nice. She has nothing to do with this. Yeah? Oh, well, you're not... Well, I don't have... Uh, to... I... Oh, oh my balls. <laughs> That's what I do. Oh. <laughs> Please. I'm big, Please, Bobby, bro. kiss him now. I got... Mm. All right, I'll... I'll... I got I got oh, my my big, oh, my spikes oh. and I got my nipples out. They're <laughs> sharp. <laughs> I, and oh, I got my uh, You let the chicken out the cage. Ma'am? No, not again. No. Please don't use don't the cock. Don't make me use the chicken. Oh, yeah. Shove it in there. Use my chicken. Get chicken. Not for fucking. No, we should be like porn. Jesse we should be porn videos and some and sick content or have a lot of that's fun with good do. characters. Hello? And then the people on the phone could say, hey. Hello? Can I get a ho? Oh. Where you Can at? Can I get a ho? Hi. 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 Good evening, Ranch County. Hi. This is Randy. <laughs> yeah, hi. Do you have the lost and found? Um, we do. Okay. I need to find something that my wife lost earlier. Okay. Um, today? Uh, yeah, it's her birthday today, and uh, she finally turned 38. And her okay. her uterus fell her uterus fell out. Oh, jeez! By gosh, she lost it, huh? Yeah, it fell right out. It just it just flopped right out and ran away. <laughs> Wait a minute! Why are you listening to something that says something about a biological male while we're having this conversation? What's going on there? I don't know what you're talking about. I hear something in the background about TikTok. I have no idea. What? 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 I'm not insane. (laughs) 
Thanks very much. TV on shift is leaving. Hello. Yeah, missed call from this number. Can you hear me now? I can hear you. I got a missed call from you early this morning. Hmm. I don't know how that could have been. I'm in I'm in Phoenix. Why are you calling me? You just called me. You just called five minutes ago. Can you hear me? I can hear you. You called me five minutes ago. I can't. I can't really understand you. You called me five minutes ago from an I, Aspen I, I number. I can't really hear you properly. I can't really understand you. This is Byron. I just had a missed call from this number. Is there a point to this? Hello? How should I know? Okay. I don't even know who you are. Thank you. Oh, okay. This is Byron. What do you need, bud? Is there a point to this? What? How should I know? Blow me. I even... Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. The person you're uh, trying to reach is not available. I'll leave him a At the tone, I'll leave him a please record idea. your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up. Hi, my name is Dwight. I'm with the Dick Sucking Committee. Byron has dispatched us, and we are currently on the way. Uh, when we get there, please have your trousers unzipped, and we'll be placing our lips upon your member. We have one man who will be working the balls. <laughs> Is it Mr. Tuber? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I ain't gay. Listen, I'll suck the shaft, but to work the balls, that's mm -hmm. the gay man's department. He'll be he'll be getting down and he'll be like, oh, gay. Okay. So the balls are a little too close to the to the hole. You know what I'm saying? To the hole, and I I don't play with that. I don't play with that. I'm straight. Okay. I'll suck a I'll suck a dick, but I'm straight. Oh, okay. Bye. In German, West is. Destin. That's Western Plus, Lincoln. Hello, you hear me? What was that? Hi, can you hear me? I'm sorry, I'm from Germany. It's my first time in your country. I'm staying in your hotel. I had a bit of a problem. Yeah, yeah, I can hear you. What's up? Oh, uh, so, like, I'm wondering if you can maybe tell the, uh, I know how you say in, in America, in the um, the bathroom attendant, if you are, will ask him to leave, please. What for? There's a man in the uniform in my bathroom in my room. You say his name is Dwight, and he is like here, and he's got the, your uniform on. He's like the bathroom man. I, I wonder you ask him to leave. It's not my custom from Germany. Um. I think you might be calling the wrong front desk. No, I am calling the correct place. I look to make sure I'm very thorough with this. Okay, we don't have a bathroom but attendant. That's what I'm wondering. I'm not sure he's supposed to be in this room, but he's like try he's trying to like vibe me and shave me and like shine shoes and things. He say his name is Dwight. Boy, goodbye. Get over here. Oh, boy. Embassy Suites Lincoln, front desk. How can I help you? Hi, there's a man in the bathroom. He keeps saying he's your attendant. Um, which bathroom? Well, the lobby bathroom. We have we have several bathrooms in the lobby. Is it the one? Okay, that's not, that's not my problem. Hot towel, sir. I have mints for you. Sir, listen, bump. I have to use the bathroom. Quit holding my hand. Okay. You can't no, escort no. me to the bathroom. And, no. I'm, and I'm giving you aftershave on your hands. Make you smell good for the ladies. No, no. I have to go in here and use the restroom. You cannot hold my hand. No, you stay at our hotel. You get the best service. You know, no exception. Ma'am, ma he won't let me use the bathroom. He keeps holding my hand. I keep trying to go into the stall. He holds my hand. Is it the one next to hmm. the bar? I, I don't probably. I smelled alcoholics over there. And you will squeeze, just squeeze my hand and you will need the more toilet paper or a wet wipe. I have a wet wipe in my pocket. I don't understand. I don't understand. He sounds, he sounds Dutch, I think. I'm from Germany. My name's Johan. I'm with the hotel. We are here to make you clean. 
Ma'am, why are you getting Germans to touch me? Why are you laughing at me? Okay, go ahead and touch it. All right, go ahead. Hold it for me while no, I pee. No, you must flush. You must no. lose it. No, no you hold must it lose for me while I pee. Hold, hold okay, it for me while I pee. Hold it for I you. Hold I, it. Hold it with I your mean, mouth. I mean, I don't have these white gloves hold for it with nothing. Your mouth. I hold it, baby. <laughs> Hello? We are last for you as a boss, sir. Hello? Hi, this is the Embassy Suites of Lincoln. How can I help you? Um, it's okay, the lady coming and taking a shower. Connector Mary, this is Chanel. How can I assist you? Hi, um, are two people allowed to shower together? Um, like in your room? Like, yeah, like if it's someone who I met, who I met, who I didn't like check in with. Um, I mean, that's kind of a personal choice you would have to make. Okay, I just didn't want to be doing anything that was like not in policy. All right, she she says it's okay. It's okay. Yeah. Come on you in. You want to take a shower? Yeah, let's go. There's a lady. She wanted tacos. I give her some tacos later. Yeah, I met him on the street. He was selling tacos. Okay, well, have fun. We will. Would you like to join us? All righty. Ask her if she wants to. Hi, you've reached the Landmark Country Inn. May I help you? Hello? My big daddy, my big daddy Dwight, wanted to talk to you. You've reached the Landmark Country Inn. May I help you? Hi. Or Eliza. Hi. I, we just wanted to let people know. We want to get them a forewarning that we're having oral sex in the room. <laughs> so if you get any complaints, I have a mouth, my mouth full of woman in my mouth. Okay, oh, I oh. will let. I'll let them know. Okay, Thank there's a man that's like... next. He's got tacos for payment. Oh, well, you have a good time. Okay. I, I have oh, had I, my dick in 40 years. But, but, but when I get my dick sucked, I'm going to blow you. He <laughs> can. Hi, yeah, we're here. You know where? No, we're here. We're out here. We're inspecting the, the hotel. We like how it looks out here. Uh, but we have a question. And I'm going to put my friend on who has the question. Here you go. Did you call the Deacon hey. Hotel? Hi. Hello? Hi, me and my boyfriend Dwight, we want to know if we can matter to you. What? We want to know if we can bench out you and your sister. Daddy, money, boss, boss, money, now. I'm coming up there. I know who are you. I know. You're not I know coming who are anywhere. You. I'm, I'm coming up there right now. You don't I'm, know. I'm telling your coach. You don't know right nothing. Now. I know everything, motherfuckers. Good day, good day, Chuti amara chod. Tadi maki boss tadi ke? Tadi maki putti boss tadi nak tadi maki putti bencho. What you are what going? You, what you gonna do? He hit you with the bencho on the hangup. That would actually make me jealous. Thank you for calling Animal Gardens. How can I help you? Is it weird to eat ass? Um, can you repeat that again? I, is it weird to eat ass? Is it weird to eat ass? 
I'm wearing it, Reeboks Yeah, right is Adidas now. weird? Oh, I like Nike. Uh, yeah. In old gardens, how may I lick you? Um, is it weird to eat someone's booty? How about that? Oh, um, I guess not that weird if you're into it. Did you hear that, Babby? Oh, it's, it's so we can we can go forward with this. Here, talk talk to her, Babby. She says she told me it's okay. Hey, I'm a little unsure. So I'm looking forward to the receiving part, but I don't have to reciprocate, do I? Um, no, I don't think so. Not if you don't want to. Whew, because I was going to be like, oh, what am I going to do? Do I use a dental dam? Yeah, well, it's certainly, um, yeah, it's certainly protection. Oh, well, yeah. Beth, but you're going to do it to me too, right? She said to do it? Uh, she said, uh, she says she's not sure. Oh. You can share one. But so but says, do you want me to do it to you? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to go. One, a two, a tres. You want me to go faster? Yeah. Okay, I go fast. Oh, no. I Here is my extra speed is the most fast, okay? Okay. <laughs> you like it? Oh shit, I think my yeah. dentures fell in there. Okay. A lady on the phone. Huh? Hello, That's lady on the phone. Dude. Hang up. Hang up, lady on the phone. I don't like you listening to me lick an ass. Hang on the phone. You calling my job. Hey. Hey, you talking about playing, German talking guys. about eating your yogurt. It's real good and creamy. I don't give a damn that you eating no yogurt. I'm about to eat German guy, yogurt. bend over. I'm going to uh, fuck. Yes, I thought you might toss for your sir. Yes, dominant sir. Give me your bamboozy. Yes, sir. That is oh, a very nice you. leather hat, sir. He's going to give you his germ bussy. Nine pack of nine. Will you oil me? I need more oil. Oh. You have shaved me, sir. Will you now make the oil? Oh. oh I fell asleep, but I woke up. He's touching me. Thank you for calling the comfort. America's best value in this, Tim. I may help you. Hello? Hello, Tim. Tim? How can I help you? Hi, me and my girlfriend are just wondering a couple of things. What are you wondering? Well, we're in one of the rooms and we just kind of got on this kind of a deep talk about sexuality. Well, I think you should keep that to yourself. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hang on. We'll talk to her. Maybe maybe I'm not explaining it correctly. I don't want to know about your sexuality. No, no, I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry. Wait, wait. Talk to her. Talk to her. I think she can explain it wait, better. Wait, wait, sir. We're just... America's Best Value in. Hey, how's it going? I uh, got a quick question uh, about the amenities here. Okay. Has a man ever tried to come and just take your manhood from you? Like, without... America's Best Value In, this is Tim. How may I help you? Hello. Oh, Tim. Hello. I'm sorry. I have the hiccups. How can I help you? Yes, I just wanted to know about, like, for staying there... 
I'm forgetting for making a room and a booking at this place. At this time. You aren't going to rent a room here tonight. What do you, what do you mean? You're not going to rent a room here tonight. We're sold out. Oh. Yeah, you're you're out. Okay? Oh, out like out of the hey. closet. Yeah, you're out. You're out. You're out. Out of the closet? You're out. Like you... you sick fuck. What? You can't Favorite sweets. How can I help you? Hey, there's this girl and she's coming over later, bro. Um I'm kind of nervous and I need some advice. The white girl. Hi. Bree? Bree? Brittany. Oh, my God. Um, My boyfriend likes the Brie cheese. His name's right here, Elasma. Okay, are you calling for, like, a real reason or are you calling to just talks back on the phone because we're not here for that. Hello? You're not here to okay, you're well, not I'll here to do your job. Your Hello. I'll be turning Ma'am? your phone number over to the police. We need a room. Oh. Hello. Oh, yeah, I call it to the police. Or does she look like Swiss? She looks like a monster. Hello. What? So you're just gonna answer the phone and pretend like you don't hear it, or you're not gonna talk? That's yeah. how you deal with people Brie don't trying to get a Buddha. room. She looks like Swiss. That's how you deal with people when you don't want to be at work. You just say, "I'm gonna call the police on you for trying to get a room." You suck, lady. Go fucking home or quit your job. Go do something you actually like doing. Cops will laugh suck. in your face for bugging them because you're stupid. Oh, I'm gonna call the police because someone called and tried to rent a room, officer. Stupid. Yeah, it's real fucking smart. Fucking idiot. I love my job, actually. Oh, I love yeah, right. Phone, yeah, right. Yeah, right. I'm not going to deal with. Okay, shut up, bitch. I don't care. Get back to work. Shut up, bitch. Get back to work. Yeah, get those varicose veins going. All right, five seven. Get back to work, bitch. Thank you. Hello? It doesn't mean I'm going to help you. Oh, hi, yeah. I had a situation outside. There was a man, he was dragging one of your toilets out, and then he was defecating out there. I'm sorry, what? He dragged, he dragged the toilet out of your room, and he's defecating out in the open. Like, there's no pipes attached to it. He's just pooping there, and he's got his pants down and everything. You can see it all. Ah, uh, what room number? I don't know. I didn't see him pull, like, I don't know what room he came from, but he pulled the toilet out, and he's pooping. Yeah, but where where do you see that? Oh, like, just, just out here. You know, I, I've i been walking around. I've been, um, I was with my wife earlier, and we were fornicating in the bushes, and uh, we saw him. He was out there, and he was like, hey, look at me. I'm taking a big shit. Look at me. And he pulled down his trousers, and then he let loose into the toilet that he, like, dragged out there, I guess. Yeah, but wh- which motel are you talking about? Where, where are you oh, staying right now? the Horizon. Look at me! And... <laughs> you hear him? You see him? Yeah. What room number are you in? Oh, I'm on the side with uh, the Adams Street. I'm on that side. Look at me! Put me over there. Yeah, this is where Ooh. you know to go. Hello? Yeah, hi. You, you hear him? Yeah. Does he work for you? Because he said he worked for you, and he was going to show me something, then he pulled down his trousers. Yeah, maybe you got a wrong number. No, no, I'm over here. Where are you at? I'm, I'm looking through the window here. You see me? I'm waving. I'm on my phone. Come on. I'm right here. You see me? No, I'm not seeing anybody. How is that? 
what am I supposed to do with this guy? I don't know. I don't know which room. Uh, if you can tell me a room number, then I can help you. But without that, oh, I cannot help you. Oh, I have my name. Last What's your name? name? Is, is Gandu. G A N D U. Look at me! This is really disgusting. Yeah, what's the last name you say? It's Gandu. G A N D U. Gandu. What you gonna do? And what's your first name? Ben. Yeah, I don't have anybody under that name. Oh, okay. All right. I'm not sure if I maybe I'm not registered here. Yeah, maybe you have a wrong number. Oh, yeah, maybe it's possible. You dropped your hotel key, dummy. Who and then me? maybe, and then maybe I kiss you. How about that, sir? Travel Lodge. Uh, yeah, we got a U-Haul truck here. We're going to be coming in soon. I was wondering if you had any uh, bookings for tonight. Bookings? What do you mean? For the... Well, room? get in and sleep, yeah. Oh, no, I ain't got no rooms available tonight. Oh, you know anywhere else I can call? Wouldn't mind, you know, because we got a truck full of uh, people here. Yeah, uh, there's one next door called Deluxe oh, Inn. They might have yeah. one. Yeah, yeah. Well, they told they us to call you because they said, uh, oh. you, we don't want your kind here, is what they said. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Uh, you tried American's Best over there by Casey's? On yeah, Superior? they also said the same. They said, said the we same. don't serve your kind because we're, uh. we're a bunch of sailors. And we're drunk as can be, and that's how we like <laughs> life to be. And they yeah. didn't want us getting too rowdy over there because we took our trousers off in the room, and there was a there was some wrestling going on and alcohol, and there was right. We had yeah, you know, we got the birds inside too. <laughs> right, yeah, I ain't got no rooms available tonight. I'm booked out. Oh God! All right, where where are we gonna go? Uh, let me get let me get them on the horn here. Hey everybody, get get on the phone. Hey, hey, hey yo. Yeah. Hey, we're, uh, we're, 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 we ain't got you ain't gonna kick. Some, we ain't got no yeah, money for that Yeah, but listen, if I pay you double, I got I just got a lot of money off the boat here. Listen, if you ain't you kick one of these motherfuckers out, I'll give you double for a room tonight, brother. I ain't got got no room available. Tag team. Yeah, my 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 mother-in-law. You make a room available. It could be in your best interest. Yeah, I ain't got cheddar. I ain't got a hundred percent in the till. You put a hundred percent in your hand, brother. You know what I'm saying? All you gotta say is bye bye to some dumb dumb. I ain't got no uh, rooms available. Well, you don't hear what I'm saying. You don't speak English. You kind of, you kind of stupid or something. Uh, oh, yeah, I speak plain fucking English. You don't. Well, we got Thank manpower you for to calling Yarm Resort. This is Cindy. I touch donkeys. Hello. <laughs> Bappy, Bappy can't sleep because the crickets are too loud. Can you hear them? Hello. Can you hear the crickets? That Bappy's having trouble to sleep. Oh, um, I I can't hear anything, sir. But are you calling from the hotel? You really can't hear these damn crickets. <laughs> Honey, why are you sleeping with the window open anyway? Ask Bappy. It's her. <laughs> Cause it's cool. Thank you for calling Durango Casino and Resort. My name is Paulina. How may I assist you? Hey, Kalina. Um, I got an issue. How do I get these crickets to stop? <laughs> I hear them. Oh, my gosh. Where is that? Yeah. Outside? Is that outside, outside your room? Yeah. room? 
Wow, they're loud. Yeah. Well, they're not in the room. So I you hope know? not. Oh my yeah, god. Um, right. Let me let me see. I don't know. <laughs> Hang on one moment for me, okay? Let me see if we can get them to. I think maybe. I think. Pray or. Okay. One, All right, one get moment, them okay? quiet. Turn them. Turn the crickets down. <laughs> right. <laughs> my goodness. One moment, please. Front desk. This is Brandon. Swatter. In my room, this is Johan. What's going on, Brandon? What's up? What's your room number? I think it's like 2.15 or something. I'm from Germany. I may have got the number wrong. I'm saying so I'm just got a confession for you, but... Hello, reservations. This is Ashley. How may I assist you? Hey, what's up, big fat Ashley? Me and this German guy want to stay there. Okay, for which day? Hello, everyone's a room in America. Hello? Um... Today, but what can you tell us about Area 15? Is that like a good place to go for tomorrow? Um, so I unfortunately don't have the information for any other venue besides our property. Do you want me to connect you with concierge? It's not a venue. It's it's not a venue. It's a fucking place. It's not another hotel, dude. Quit being ridiculous. I know you're a human and not an AI or a bot. You're allowed to tell me about places in Vegas, especially if I'm going to stay in there. Are you not? Or are you just going to fucking act like you just read a script all day? Because I will go somewhere else. Okay, sir, I'm going to go ahead and disconnect. Thank you. Have a good night. Thank you for calling Green Valley Ranch Resort Spa and Casino. My name is Paulina. How may I assist you? Paulina, are you in the middle of everything like by Fremont Street or the Strip? I'm sorry, say that one more time. Are you in the middle of everything like Fremont Street or the Strip? No. We're way off of the Strip. Where are you? We are in Henderson. Are you by Area 15? No. Not even close. Can you can you tell me about Area 15, please? The last time I, don't that I know. called, they're like... <laughs> <laughs> Area 15. I know you can go there and, I don't know, ride something. <laughs> Give me one second. Let me see what I can find. Thank you. Of course, Thank you no for problem. doing that. Oh, my God. You're the best. I love you. I don't, I don't know why people just don't take the time to just look it up. I mean, it's... Come on. Oh okay, let's my see. Area God. Fifteen. Yes. Uh-huh. It's the easiest thing you can do. You're on your dang phone anyway. Look it up. You know. That's what I but do. I just want to ask someone who lives there. You know, like I, I, of course I can look it up and I'll get biased reviews. And there's people that get paid to leave fake reviews and dumb, stupid bullshit. I want to, to talk to someone who's real, a real person, <laughs> a real human being. Immerse yourself in the world beyond. <laughs> Area 15 is the most. Yeah. Is it our all ages? Free tickets. I'm reading to see. I know a lot oh. of people. You can do like virtual reality stuff and um, rides. They even have um, entertainment. And of course, they have all okay. drinks and food and all that. Let me see. They have passes. Let me see. What did you yeah, want to I'm know specifically about? Bappy. Oh, oh, you no, are? I was okay. just thinking of a cool place to take my wife, Bappy, and, you know, I'm trying to rekindle our marriage, and I, shit's been kind oh, there of you go. crazy lately, and, yeah, and she, like, sometimes, I don't know if she's cheating or not, but, like, sometimes when I'm not there, she'll, she'll like, try and flirt with people. That's what I've heard, but I've never caught her, so... My wife. Oh wow! Wow. Um, there's a lot to do there actually. Um, book a free entry pass. You can get a free entry pass to get in there. The art room district normal color applies. If you go onto the website, you can get get a free. You can get a free entry pass. Bappy, go ahead and ask what you want to do because so we could um get the stuff done. 
Yeah, like what types of, like, do you know what kind of beverages they have? But don't be fucking flirting with him. I'm going to pass you the phone and go get our food from the kitchen. Okay. Food and drink. Let me look. See what they have. Wow. Wow, it's really cool in there. Cool bar. It's really cool. Wow. I might have to go there. (laughs) Wow. They have they have any kind of cocktail drinks you want, any kind of beer, frozen drinks, a rocket fizz. I don't know what that is. Oh. Uh, they have pool tables and foosball tables. Uh, they have oh. golf. They have a lounge for live music. They have Happy a lounge. I like to lounge. And it looks to be about it. Awesome. Thank you so much. That's all I needed to know. I appreciate you. All right. Have a good day. Thank you for calling Green Valley. Bye-bye. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No. Viewers start. Thank you for calling Circa Resort. You were supposed to start flirting as soon as I left. zero at any time to speak with a hotel. Please hold. Area 15. It looks so cool. Operator, this is Jordan. Are you really, Bappy? You're looking at Area 15? Hey, what's up, Jordan? Hey, how's it going? I was. Is my wife wants to go to Area 15. Should we go? Uh, Yeah, I mean, it's okay. Would you go? Like, would you take your wife there? I mean, I've been there like twice, but it's it's okay. Yeah, it's like a bar. Sometimes there's music and then the meow wolf. Okay, where would you go if there's like a better place or whatever? <laughs> I'm not too sure. You're just calling the hotel operator, so. Well, here, you talk to my wife. And baby, stop fucking getting flirty with people, okay. dude. I'm going to have to okay. fucking kick you out. Okay. All right, here, girl. Right, yeah. Talk to my wife. All right. Okay. So, what can you tell me about it? Area 15? Yeah. I mean, we're not really associated with it, so, <laughs> I mean. Yeah, um, but, like, like do you, do you, do you, do you go there? I've been there, like, twice ever. It's, it's okay. They have the Meow Wolf thing, the art, like, gallery sort of thing. And then sometimes oh. they have music, like a DJ, and there's a bar there. That's all I'm aware of. Ah. Uh. Is it like uh like what kind of music do you like? It's it's mostly like EDM, electric da- like uh, dance music. You? No, not me, but that's what they play there. Oh, you're be are you being shy? Oh, well, this is just like not related to what we're here for. So do you need assistance oh, I with know. the hotel? I'm sorry. Yeah, I, you're assisting me. You're doing a great job assisting me. <laughs> All right. Well. You guys have a great night. Um, let's hope you enjoy Area 15. Have a good one. Stupid. I'm stupid. Hello? Good evening. Thank you for calling front desk. My name is Danny. How may I assist you? Hi. Yeah. Uh, we got a little situation brewing here, out here. Um, I was walking by, and I got my foot stuck, and, and there's a hole out here. And then this lady came by, and she thought I was being lewd. And so she sprayed me in the eyes with pepper spray. But she's still here, and this guy's here, and he's trying to sell me tacos, and he's been trying to force-feed me tacos, and I don't know what to do. I'm really scared. I'm Open so sorry mouth. to hear about I don't want it. I want it anymore. Open your mouth. Oh. Oh. Open. Oh. One, two, three. Here. Oh. Oh. Open your fucking mouth. Oh. Eat it. Eat the taco, cometelo. Soplalo, soplalo. Yes. Sí. Estás wey, cabrón. Hello? He's still here. He shoved a taco up my throat. Oh, God. Another one. No. Uno más. Oh, Another one. Come on, open, open. Oh. Oh. What is your room number? Ah, oh, yes, eat the fucking taco, man. Oh.
Eat it, the fuck. <laughs> Slide the taco in. Make them swallow. Get your tonsils. Little oh. bit of. Good evening, Sounding guest like. services. I'm sorry? So my girlfriend won't let me keep these these uh, paintings I've done anymore. Hello? Hello? Sorry, I was I was talking to somebody else in the background. Are you there? Hello? How can, can I help me? you? Thank you for calling Santa Fe Station. This is Pam. How may I assist you? Hi, Pam. Pam? Hey, what's Hello? up, Big Fat Pam? How are you doing? This is Byron. What do you need, bud? Is there a point to this? What? How should I know? Blow me. I'm... Hello? Hi, this is Mark at the Landmark Country Inn. I just picked up the phone. We got disconnected. I'm sorry about that. What are you, you were... talking about? I just got a phone call from you, this number, and... What? At the Landmark Country Inn. How do you know my number? It, it came up on there, and we were disconnected when I picked it up, and I didn't want you to think I was hanging up on you. What? What is my phone number? Uh, hang on, seven six nine. Okay, what is hang my on. phone number? It is seven six nine four four seven one two four one. What is what is my phone number? Area code seven six nine four four seven one two four one. Yeah, I'm getting phone calls. Oh, okay. So you weren't you weren't trying to to, to book a room, is what you're saying. Hello. What? Kids, oh my dear Madhouse family, oh my goodness, what a perfect show. See how much fun we can have. We put our minds together, the creativity flows. All of us together right here in this Madhouse militia family. We're on a journey together and together we can overcome all adversity, pain and fear and anger in our world. We're learning that laughing at our problems melts the ways to grief of our troubles as we find that our strength is the power of laughter, kindness, and joy. We're learning that our differences are trivial and that we're all really more alike than different. Isn't it true? If you're not sure, then keep listening to Madhouse Militia. Together, we're healing our collective souls with the magical power of laughter right here on the Madhouse Militia Show every week, Friday at 10 p.m. right here in the real office. Madhouse Militia is saving the world one laugh at a time. We're dropping the dimes. We only ask that you give us the time and bring a friend or better yet, bring an enemy. Because you know what? They're all welcome right here in the Madhouse Militia. I want to thank all of my dear family, my beloved, each and every one of you for keeping me alive, sharing the energy, keeping us all alive, We're all inspired by our dear brother in heaven, Carlito, the Generalissimo of the Mad House, inspiring us with these groovy thoughts that we have right here, which we can share. Thank you so much to my dear brother, Axel, helping me carry this gigantic torch forward. Without him, we couldn't keep the wheels turning. This man is a weightlifter that you wouldn't believe. 
who joins the wheels together each week. We thank and love this guy. Thank you so much, Axel. Also want to put out a big high five and a thank you to Wasting Machines for keeping this groovy stage here that we use every week and allowing us this platform to reach out to the world. Send a communication beam out to everybody. Thank you so much. And if you're looking for more entertainment, we got plenty of Madhouse Militia family entertainment. Tomorrow night, D. White has a regularly scheduled show. Please tune in. If D. White is there, he will perform and he will provide plenty of humor. And if not, we always have our dear cat machine with the big screen. This girl puts on all the coolest, grooviest movies. And if you're really into it, join early. And you can get in there and vote for some of the cool, groovy screen flicks that are going to pop up in front of us all. But I couldn't do it without you. And I ask that you please keep on giving kindness to the world. And the world will reflect and return it right back to you. Madhouse Malicious Style. Thank you so much. This has been the Milkman heading back to space. Thank you.